the Miami Dolphins shocked the NFL world when they traded for six-time pro bowler Tyreek Hill on Wednesday. The whirlwind development began when Tom Pelissero and Ian Rapoport reported the Kansas City Chiefs and Hill had hit a snag in contract talks. In response, the Chiefs gave Hill and his team permission to seek a trade. He wasn't on the market long, as the Dolphins quickly agreed to ship five draft picks to Kansas City for the star receiver. Not long after, Miami announced an extension for Hill that made him the highest-paid receiver in the league. It was a shocking development that adds to the Dolphins' increasingly formidable offensive attack. It's an unprecedented amount of picks to give up for a receiver, but let's look at three things that justify this trade. 3. Massive boost for Dolphins' offense. Tyreek Hill joins a growing cast of capable pieces on the offensive side of the ball for the Miami Dolphins. Hill, along with free agent signees Raheem Mostert, Teron Armstead, and Connor Williams, joins Jalen Waddell, Devontae Parker, and Mike Jasicki as Tua Tungavailoa's supporting cast. Surrounding a young quarterback with talent is essential when evaluating whether or not he's capable of being the franchise guy. Tua presumably falls into that category after two up and down years and now a new head coach. With Hill's addition, the Dolphins should be able to definitively say if Tua is the answer by season's end. 2. Dolphins still have picks. Yes, they gave up five for Hill, including their first and second round pick in this year's draft. But they held on to both of their first rounders in 2023. Mike McDaniel can thank his former team for giving them the draft capital needed to pull a trade like this. And when you look at it from a value by round standpoint, this trade starts to look similar to the trade that sent Devontae Adams to the Raiders. The Dolphins gave up the 29th and 50th overall picks in the 2022 draft. The Raiders sent the Packers the 22nd and 53rd pick. The three other picks the Dolphins gave up were two fours and a six. According to DraftTech's trade value chart, those three picks combined value is worth roughly 25% of the 50th overall pick and just 16% of the 29th pick. The quantity is high, but the draft pick quality is not outrageous. 1. Mike McDaniel has a new Swiss Army knife. We all saw what McDaniel did with Debo Samuel last year. Assuming he brings Shanahan's zone blocking scheme with him to Miami, Tyreek Hill could be even more effective than Samuel. Though he lacks the same power as Debo, Hill has unmatched speed, and defensive coordinators will have nightmares of linemen downfield in front of Hill on a jet sweep. The Miami Dolphins gave up a lot for Tyreek Hill, there's no denying that. But, five picks, doesn't tell the whole story. With Tua surrounded by playmakers, and a new coach with an eye for getting his playmakers the ball, the Dolphins will look back on this trade fondly.